Hey guys, my name is Allison and welcome back to my channel. Alright, what's up guys? Um, today I'm going to talk about coat maintenance for your curly coated breeds and um, honestly just a wide variety of breeds in general and how to protect your dog's coat mainly is what I want to talk about. Um, even if you're not competing, a lot of it is really important and there are some awesome, 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 awesome products out there to help us protect our dog's coat um, for our hair cutting purposes. Okay, so the stuff I want to show you is from a company called Adorn Rose. Um, I have a lot of their stuff here sitting in the floor. You can't even see it, but I'm going to show you all. And it's all just to help protect your dog's coat. Um, so that way you can give it a better haircut pretty much in the future. So yeah. Alright, is that lighting a little better? I don't really know. I tried to help turn the light on and see if that helped over here. It's getting dark out so quick now. Um, anyway, so first up, the, a lot of this is poodle stuff, but I will explain how this can work for other breeds as well too. So first I'm going to show you my pants I got. So we've got front legs, front leg poodle leg covers, and back leg, Oop. back leg poodle leg covers. So this basically goes on like pants. They are pants for your dog. Um, like so, you would put their leg in here like this. Um, and the purpose of this is to really just like protect your dog's leg coat um especially if you have boy poodles or um i'm trying to think of other breeds you could use for probably like your setters and those dogs and stuff if you have any males that you know sometimes they pee on their front legs it is very frustrating if they are white especially to keep those dogs white and not yellow um so these are for protecting their coat so the back of their legs aren't turning yellow if they're like messy pot ears um and i've also used them i have a girl and i use them when we travel because she gets a little car sick she drools really bad so she kind of lays on her front legs so just to protect her legs um and her coat from all the mess and it helps it does wonders especially even when they're out in the rain these are for the back legs or um like for the bad weather snow like literally everything just to protect your dog's hair because when you need to grow that hair out for competitions or for a certain haircut that you're just really wanting to learn or whatever the purpose is if you need to grow that hair out you can't have it breaking off so you really just need to protect that coat the best you can all right so to go along with that i have a snood that matches um now this snood is awesome a lot of the snoods that i have seen is they're like a lot smaller and I don't know why I love this size snood like it's perfect I think um, and it pretty much if you don't know what a snood is it is um, I don't know a good way to explain it you put it you like put this over their head like this and it holds their ears so it keeps like their ears from going in their water bowl it keeps them from chewing on their ears it kind of just really protects that ear hair and that coat so it doesn't break off um like i said especially for my dog who gets kind of car sicky it really helps um cause she likes to drool on her ears and her ears will go in her mouth while she's in the car and so it just kind of keeps them out of the way and really healthy it's really hard to grow coat on ears so this right here is a lifesaver especially you know if you feed your dogs raw um, this will help keep their ears out of the food bowl and like I mentioned out of the water bowl all of that's really important and then you've got this is great so like all cocker people use this American cockers English cockers um, your setters like all of those dogs wear snoods for show so um, not just a poodle thing, definitely any dog that you need to protect their ear hair for. And then you've got, um, the best thing, in my opinion, 
is this right here. It is a um, collar that protects the dog's coat. So it has a like choke lead sewn into it. So you can tighten it up. It's underneath the ribbon in there. And it literally has like, it's super nice. It's like got this silky texture on the inside. Look, they even have their own tags sewn into their stuff. It's just phenomenal. So, um, this one matches the set. I have the whole set of everything, right? And one other thing I haven't shown y'all yet. So this is to protect their coat on their neck. You have a poodle or a curly coat dog, especially, and you use a regular collar, it's going to break all of this coat on the back of their neck here, which we use for their crest to blend their head into their body. And um, it, the whole haircut just doesn't look good unless you have that. So this really protects that coat. Like this, if you don't want, like if you don't use any of the things I show you, this is the most important one. You have to have a collar that protects that coat on the back of their neck. Like even for my Bichon, she has one. Like it is crucial, crucial. Even for your pet trims, it is crucial. Like I wish I could convince and like explain this to all my clients with them like actually understanding because all of your clients need these. Like these are like, if you have a poodle or a Bichon or dogs that break neck, coat hair like this is what you have to have okay um and then I have some other ones too I'm going to show you all so super great and like I said it, it protects that neck coat and all of this coat and it does it without breaking I mean you still don't want to leave a collar on there all day but like if you have to put a collar on it to go outside or to do anything it's just really great to have one that's not going to break the coat because even if you have those collars on for like an hour uh, even if you have them on for 30 minutes or less like that's too long you're breaking coat um and it, it's really you don't really realize it until you're trying to do these more extravagant haircuts and stuff and then it becomes a really big issue and it's really hard to grow that coat back like sorry my dog is sleeping on her couch like a spoiled little little princess so let me show you what i'm talking about um this hair right here on the back of her head is actually like super long it needs to be so much longer like i don't even know how to explain to you how much longer this coat back here needs to be because it needs to be a lot longer but this is the longest coat on her body is the back of her neck um because it needs to grow to fill like all of this area so i can make a nice little swoop there in the back so this is like i don't know like four four inches five inches of coat right here um and she actually before we got our collar was wearing a lead that didn't require a um collar and so it would still i thought that was help like kind of like okay but it still wasn't because you can even see it's not that bad anymore because i've been kind of grooming her but it gives it like a dip right there if i make it more noticeable you can see it right there it dips in and then comes back out and that is from her wearing that leash. And I mean, literally would only wear it for like five minutes at a time to go to the bathroom, like when I'm at work, take her outside, come back in. But you, it literally, it does, it kills the coat. So you've got to like protect that coat hair. All right, and next up, just because it's awesome, they have panties. Um, it has a removable little rose on there because every girl needs a little rose. And these are probably the most like well-made panties I've ever seen for dogs. Like some of them are really, uh, they like are really cheaply made. This has like got such good materials on this guys. Um, so, you know, basically if you don't know, the reason you would need panties um, is for when your dog goes into heat and you don't want blood everywhere. This one actually even has a spot for their tail to go through um and like i said this is not just for poodles this is not just a poodle thing all dogs go into heat if they're not fixed um and you would just put a pad a little panty liner in here like you do for people and your dog would wear this and be perfectly perfectly fine and good to go good to go you just change out the pad like 
like normal and you'd be fine. Take this off so you can go to the bathroom like outside and be fine and, and it's great because it all matches. <laughs> like this is what makes me so happy is having this whole set that like all matches like pants, a snud, a collar, panties, like your dog's gonna have the whole thing. Like a lot of time, like you can find snuds, you can find collars, you can find panties, you can find pants, you can find all of these products, but I've never seen a whole set of all of it that all matches. So honestly, that's one of my favorite things about this whole set. Um, this was my first experience with poodle pants because I have never had a dog that needed pants. So these are the first ever pants I've ever used. Um, and they're really nice. I really like the spandex in them for staying on. I don't have to tie them. I don't have to do anything. So they're really easy to use. They're not made to be on the dog all day. The pants, you know, they're just made to put on while you go outside, go on while you're traveling, take them off. Like, they're just kind of short-term, helpful products. And the collar, same thing. You don't want to leave a collar on the dog, on your dog 24-7. It's just, just a really helpful, short-term product. Uh, same with the snud. Like, that's all of these stuff is not made to be on the dog 24-7. Um, you know, that'd be really uncomfortable. It's just there to help you and guide you and protect your dog's coat while you're trying to grow it out. also show you the other collars that I got so I got the whole matching set of everything and then I also got some work I, I shouldn't have worn this shirt all my stuff's blending in with what I'm wearing right now because my shirt's purple obviously purple is my color guys um but this little one look so it is it's hard to tell in this lighting i'm so sorry i'll post um the links to everything but you can see it better on their website and their instagram it's purple with a black lace overlay with this black frill in it with the studs and it is oh it's stunning honestly like <laughs> and like this one also has the choke collar sewn in so i mean everything is like really thought through and this is a fully functioning dog collar and the inside is that really awesome silk with their awesome little tag um so it's going to protect your dog's coat it's not it's not going to rub it off it's not going to break off it's not going to anything it's going to protect it while your dog has to wear a collar and if your dog has to wear a collar it might as well be this freaking cute can we just like Excuse me, can I have one of these? Okay, this is where it gets like super crazy. <laughs> look at this collar. Just look at it. <laughs> ah, look at it. Look at it, look at it, look at it, look at it. Seriously guys, look. This is crazy. So this is a collar that I got from my Bashan. This is one of their specialty collars and this is one of their specialty collars. Their um, regular collars are these ones, but you can like upgrade to some better stuff. So of course, like I had to try everything out, you know what I mean? So this is one I got from my Bashan and it's just like the others it's got the lining in it that's gonna protect my dog's coat um it's just also hella fancy let me just put this on her just 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 hang on do y'all see this right now
Is this even real life? Nikki! Hi, darling. Stunning. I'm sorry, I'm just really obsessed. This is like my favorite. So let's be honest, if that's not the cutest thing you've ever seen, then you're lying. <laughs> Cause like, look, it's like a little teddy bear now. Like, she's so mad at me. I had to give her a bath today. So she's like, can you please stop messing with me, mom? But never, never. So coat maintenance is something we do every day but we don't think about and um these products are things that we as groomers a lot of us don't use and we need more of us need to be using them instead of um just for show use because it's all really important stuff that um we need to be educating our clients and, and everything because, I mean, I spend how many hours a month on my dog? So why would I not protect the dog's coat? Like, um, there are products out there. They're here. They are here. They have, they have made it here for us to make our jobs easier. So, um, yeah, I'm really happy with everything really really happy with everything it's a great line and um i don't even know guys i just love all this stuff like their um customer service is really out of this world their website's really awesome i will tag and link everything below but it is a new company and because of such they are graciously enough to do a giveaway with me for you guys on YouTube here only. Um, so if you're watching this video and you've made it this far, congratulations because now you get to enter the giveaway. Um, but yeah, so they're going to give away one collar. One collar. Uh, all you have to do to enter their giveaway is to follow them on Instagram right here here's their instagram um like this video give this video a thumbs up share this video to a groomer and that's just going to be on the honor system i i might not know if you did it or not but share this video to somebody who needs to learn about some poodle bichon coat maintenance and how to protect their dog's coat send it to somebody please do do your groomer friend a favor and send them this video and that's going to be on the honor system but you do have to follow them on instagram give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for a chance to win the giveaway we will be drawing the winner a week from today and that'll be october 22nd that's on a tuesday at 7 p.m. Eastern time. So make sure if you want a chance to win one of these beautiful collars that you follow them on Instagram, Adorn Rose. Like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this video to another groomer. Help them out. Let's help out our community, right guys? Um, so yeah, that's really all I got tonight. It was really simple and easy and I just wanted to show you this new company and all their products because they're amazing and I love them and I'm so happy with all my stuff and it's just, I mean, look at this. Look at it. Look at it. So yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. Um, but make sure you're protecting your dog's coat because it's more important than you realize. And like this video, subscribe to my channel as always, which you have to do if you want to enter the giveaway. And make sure you follow me on Instagram because that is where I'll be keeping you all posted with updated information, new videos, new giveaways, all that fun stuff. And that's pretty much all I got for you guys. So I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Thank you.